my name is Nigel Streeter, and I'm a former police officer from South Wales in the United Kingdom. And I'm here to introduce this information film in which you will see Simon Weston CBE and Rosie Moriarty Simmons OBE talking about PTSD and stress-related mental ill health. First of all, we're going to hear from Simon and then we're going to hear from Rosie. Hello, my name is Simon Weston and the point of me being involved in this film is because of PTSD. PTSD is something that came to the fore as a mental illness after the Falklands War and tragically it wasn't picked up. Lots of men didn't display or present with it because they didn't know what was going on. Mental health is one of the biggest illnesses on this planet. We need to be able to come forward and tell people, don't be scared to say something, don't be scared to present, don't make it think, or don't you think that you feel like you're weak because of it. Hello, my name is Rosie Moriarty Simmons. People in certain circumstances, including high pressure jobs, coping with physical or mental ailments, financial and domestic difficulties, or social exclusion, can often be more prone to being affected by PTSD and stress-related illness. But it's important to say that on many occasions, this condition is absolutely no respecter of occupation, social class, ability, background, wealth, race or colour, and can affect anybody at any time. Speak to your GP. Start the ball rolling. You don't have to have suffered physical injury. You could have seen people being hurt, animals being knocked over in the street, it could be any number of different things. Please don't ignore it. See your doctor or seek professional help. The one thing you have to understand is that we're all the same because we're all different. We're all different because we're all the same. It's not just there for the uniform branches of our protectorate either. Whether you're Army, Navy, Air Force, Police, Fire Service, a Coast Guard, Lifeboat Service, all of these people don't feel that you can't present with it. If you have a problem, see somebody. Because, believe it or not, it's one of the illnesses that can be cured very quickly if it presents and people get the opportunity to help. And people do want to help. I was so lucky that in the end I got the help I needed. Get the help you deserve. Just don't think that it can't happen to you, because it can. I didn't think it could happen to me. Please go get the help that you deserve. So, thank you very much for watching. As I said earlier on, the message is very simple but very important. If you feel like you can't cope, or you feel that whatever is normal to you doesn't feel normal, speak to your GP, seek out specialist medical help. Get the help that you deserve. It really is okay to say. It's okay to say. It really is okay to say. Thank you.